Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to this video and uh, because I just bought Civilization 5 I had nothing but issues running it and uh, getting it to start and it crashed a lot so apparently according to the internet a lot of other people have had this problem as well so I thought I'd make this video to show everyone what I did to fix it you can start off by going to libraries, documents, my games and they, I've only got Civ Sid Meier's Civilization 5 we open this up and in user settings this is to disable the intro movie which seems to uh, crash for a lot of people so we're going to open with notepad um, and then all this will come up and I know it looks daunting if you don't know uh, anything about this kind of stuff but if, if you do it's easy if you don't it's fairly easy as well we want to go down here where it says skip intro video this will normally have a zero so to make it authentic there's the zero uh, you want to go delete that zero make it one and then that should skip the intro video you can save that and then reboot the PC or your laptop or whatever it is that you're using uh, I can close this without saving it because I've already uh, saved it. And from there, when we go into um, wherever it is, we'll open up Steam and we'll go into our library of games. And this is probably the most important thing to make it not crash after a few after a few turns or a couple of hundred turns or a few uh, 20 or so minutes, which happens to me a lot. When we click play, uh, we want to run it in DirectX 9. Uh, I've found that it hasn't crashed once when running it in DirectX 9. I don't, I don't quite know what the difference is. There's no difference graphically or how it plays. It actually plays a lot smoother for me in DirectX 9. You'll notice that since the intro video gone, for me anyway, it takes a fairly long time to actually load the game. So I hope this has helped. Um, like I said, if, you, if the intro video you want to skip, then go and change it value to 1. And if you're having crash issues, just run it in DirectX 9. If you continue to actually have crash issues, issues, there's really a really easy fix for that. Go in DirectX 9, that's worked for me. And if you've still got problems, go into Options and turn the graphics, everything down to low and minimum, and it should work really well. And after all, you know, it's a civilization game. Who cares what it looks like? If, as long as you can run it's here for example in the video options everything's set to minimum low low minimum low low off low low and that where it works really well and has not crashed for me yet so I hope this has helped until next time ladies and gentlemen au revoir